Welcome back to the channel. It's your boy King Phillip. Like I said, man, well, y'all seeing the wardrobe here, it, it ain't changed. Anyway, uh, I'm back. Um, Kip knocking out some reviews tonight. Some, you know what I'm saying? Just trying to take advantage of the free time I got while my son knocked out. But anyway, uh, I saw this trailer, man. I said, man, let me go ahead and watch it in here. I might as well just do a review to it while I'm watching it too, because I've been waiting to see this. I really wasn't sure about doing a review on it, but anyway, um, yeah, I saw this trailer, man, and I wasn't really sure, like, I, I think it, I think I started it, and, um, uh, it seemed like it might be like, like, a um, I, I, I don't know, about a porn star or something, I don't know, and I'm taking a guess, because I, I think it started just playing one time and I was just like, what the hell is this freaky ass shit? But anyway, let's check it out, man. See what the hell is going on with Matt Scene. And, so. and another thing I thought too, I was like, shit. They, uh, A24 be having these weird, strange type of movies, man. And I like weird, strange type movies. So anyway, let's check it out. So, Matt Scene. Your agent tells us you're quite a popular name in adult film and entertainment. Okay, so I went too far off. I see why. I'm curious, did you always want to be in that line of work? Always wanted to be famous. You mean like, that motherfucker looking good right now, boy. That little makeup and them fake uh, freckles, I guess. She turned the camera and through her trauma, addresses the lens directly. 1985. I was thinking, is this supposed to be like the story of Tracy Lores or something? Or is this just based on a true story that we never knew? Or is this some. I don't know. I'm, I'm waiting for the based on a true story to pop up. I don't think it is, though. Oh, man. Old girl had a face uh, colored like Jim. Well, it looked like. I love these time period movies, man. Like this. I love me a time period movie, especially 80s and 90s type shit. Can't beat it. Oh, oh, Johnny Esposito. What did I even say his name? Mr. Tuxedo. Damn, they be about to put that nigga with some keys, boy. Jeez. It be wild. Looking like Jim, girl. Oh, it'd be wild, cuz. Man, seeing it, yeah, that's gonna be good. Damn, that's gonna be real good. Coming soon. Hold on, bro. That shit still talking about coming soon. They dropped the trailer a month ago? The hell? <laughs> what kind of shit? Like, bro, like, that was a month ago. Well, damn, my dumb ass. Oh, nigga, that was a month ago. They they don't know. I, I, so I wonder when it's going to come out. Like, maybe they weren't sure a month ago. But it's a month later. Yeah. Anyway, that looks good. That looks good. I'm very impressed. Um, A chick out here, like, murdering. She's like a murderer by nature, but, it, but she's wanting to be something special like a an adult movie star i don't know that's wild it, it's gonna be good though it's gonna it's gonna be good man I, i'm yeah i'm gonna check it out but uh if y'all saw it what y'all think oh yeah before i even get out of here the the cast because it just hit me um like, damn, nigga, that's all you gonna talk about? Anyway, 
all-star cast. Hold on, was that Kevin Bacon again? Hey man, Kevin Bacon have been in about two dang things I done watched tonight. But uh but whole cast, man. Whole cast looks great. Um and my boy John Esposito, Mr. Tuxedo, have you say a name? Uh yeah, that's gonna be a crazy movie, man. I mean, just think you I mean, I forgot old girl name who playing the killer, but you got her, Kevin Bacon, if I ain't mistaken. Watch watch I go back and watch this and be like Nigga, it was no Kevin Bacon. <laughs> but anyway, Kevin Bacon. Uh, whoever else, whoever else, whoever else. And then you just see John Esposito. That going to be crazy. But uh, if you saw the trailer, what did you think? Let me know in the comments. And I'll check you later.